Welcome back everyone, welcome back to our everyday living. It does look strange looking at a washing machine. Normally I pull them apart. But this one we're going to repair. We are fixing a Samsung 7.5 kilo washing machine. WF8750LSW. Um, we're replacing the handle today. It does not have a handle. So it doesn't it does latch but um yeah once you latch it you can probably see that people have been trying to pry it open so let's get to i've been waiting for this part let's get to and replace the handle that goes in there let's get into this so we only need a pair of pliers now I'm doing this from start to finish so it is a broken door handle got the new part here um, even got I'll tell you how much it all cost me in the end how much the door handle cost pair of long nose pliers little screwdriver and a Phillips head in the drill so let's take this off first take the whole thing off of course makes life easy Make sure you don't lose the plate behind. Sometimes they don't stick them down from behind or, or in front. So we're just being careful. Uh, finish with that for a second. Be careful when you're taking these off that you, the extra plate that those screws that I just took out doesn't slip out. Now hopefully, wiggle, wiggle. It sounds like it. Yes, this one's been taped. Now you can probably notice that there's a bit of tape there and yeah, so that's good. Anyway, this goes this way so we can undo it. We don't need those tools yet. This is the one we need. Go around, undo all your screws. Sometimes they're a torque bit, sometimes they're not. You will not need to remove the hinge. In this model, the hinge should be actually mounted into the grey part of the plastic. So we'll put that down. Grab all of our screws out. Could have done that as I was going, I know. No fingernails. Certainly not what I'm used to pulling apart, but no, we're going to be putting this back together. Flip it over, then in your hinge section, just get underneath there, pry it off. There's no clips on this one. Just to be sure, take it off easy and straight. All right, I'll just sit this over here. It's out of the road. Now, we need our long nose pliers and our new tool, new handle I should say, all we've got to do is pull that pin out there, right on the end with the long nose pliers, to make it easy, unclip the spring, there, Pull the pin out, pull your latch out, sit in there so you don't lose nothing, spring included, try not to flip your spring over so you don't forget like I sometimes do, pop our new handle open, get it out of the packet, get the old one out, she definitely broke. Pop the new one in. 
that way round, I think. No, that way round. Yeah, that way round. That way round. Put your spring back in. Way down in there. Grab this, it's so quick and simple. This is only a short video for everyone. So, we'll be doing a little bit more on fixing washing machines and that sort of thing. Trying to think of what we can do for you all. Line your handle up, line your spring up. Come on, go in the hole. Get in that hole. Doesn't want to go in the hole. Here we go. Now we grab this. Make sure you put it the right way around so it's facing towards you, the hooky piece. Most of them are pretty much the same. They always face away. Lift the spring up so that the pin can go through. Through there. Push it through a little bit more. That's in there. Now all we have to do is put our spring back. Come on, grab it properly. In there. This one in the other side. Like so. Then we replace it all back together. Grab that, pop that into there. Let's see if it works first. Yes, that's gonna work perfectly. Turning back over, replace the screws. Quick and simple. For something that would have went to scrap, I know this one would have went to scrap because I picked it up myself. Thought, oh, can't get the door open. We'll plug it in, find out if it actually works. And went through every single cycle. Not a fault at all. So I thought, well, okay, how am I going to get the door open? So I took the top off, got down inside, wiggled around with the latch, got it undone. So I thought, well, okay, find out how much that is. And I thought, well, I'll get more. Where do I do, do that other screw? I will get more if I can fix this thing up. Fix the Samsung washing machine up. And sell it on Marketplace. So this is why sometimes it's best to see what the problems are before you think about actually taking it to the scrapyard. Recycle. Yes, it's all recycling still, but if you can actually generate it back into the, someone else's hands where they can use it more, especially if there's no faults, no problems with it, only a door handle, even if it's, say, a water problem like I'm having over here, um, trying to find out whether I've fixed the problem and that sort of thing. So... Like, for the little parts that I do, it's pretty good, I reckon. Bit of torque onto that. Try not to over-torque these, because you can strip them. If you had got any sort of wash machine of this sort. Now, where'd that other bolt go? I dropped it on the ground. Can't see with the glasses on. It's down there somewhere. Anyway, we'll get it on. Get the door on. We'll find it when we get closer to the ground. It's probably under the machine. It certainly is. Pop that onto there. It's right there. That into there. Give it a bit of a torque. The bottom one. that. Now, I was not able to. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Now, all I have to do with that 
is give it a bath all around the joints and that sort of thing. Makes it look a lot bit more presentable for every for whoever goes and buys it. It is only a 7.5 Samsung washing machine, but all in all, it's only cost. Here we go. Freight's the killer. It's only cost me $34.90. That's with freight. So she was 18, the part was actually $18.95. Postage, $15.95. Postage is a killer all the time. But anyway, hope you've enjoyed tagging along with me on this one, everyone. It's only a short one for you all. Um, there's no dents in the machine at all. It's pretty good that way. I don't mind it. Give it a bit of a clean and a dust up around the back. So yeah, but anyway, if you've come this far with this one and enjoyed tagging along with me with Fixing the door on a Samsung wash machine, 7.5 WF8750LSW machine. That's the model. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, don't forget to hit the notification bell. That way you get notified when we put a new video out. So till next time, everyone, happy dumpster doing, happy scrapping, and happy fixing in the same time. I'll see you in the next one. Cheerio.